Hello everybody, I'm Epoxy Pete and today I'm going to show you how to do some cove. A lot of people always have questions about this, they're afraid to do it. I'm going to show you how easy it is. First of all, we want to mark our four inches with our cove trial and put up either our cove strip or you can use tape, either one cove strip is always preferred. So we have that marked already. So the next thing we want to do is we always want to prime our surface. We want to prime our surface to wet it out and make it easier for the cove to stick to it. So today we have some cove primer. It's a two to one mix. We just dunk that in there together, a small kit. You can mix it up with a drill depending on what you have there. And we just want to mix that up real well. We prefer to use a drill for everything. For this small little patch, we're going to use this. I'm going to just prime that up. that sit on the wall for eh, five ten minutes is good it'll tack up a little bit okay our next step is going to be mixing the epoxy cove so we'll pour our resin and our hardener into our bucket and we're going to mix the liquids only now we're going to start adding our sand Okay, our next step will be applying the epoxy mortar to our base. What you want to do is just go in your bucket, grab a marginal trowel, and I just kind of just throw it against, against the, uh, the base there. Finish up here. Just throw some in there. You can always take up the excess if need be. And then what you want to do is you just want to kind of take your marginal trowel or your regular trowel and you just want to kind of just scrape it up the wall. And it's just going to give you a base to work off of. If you have too much on there, that's okay. We'll just push it off or take it off as we go along. But usually you'll have a guy come, come right in front of you and start doing that. So then you can get your trial after that. And what you want to do is hold it up against your base and apply your pressure to tip the top of your trial. And just smooth it up. By applying some pressure, you can always take your, pull your excess down. And it's as easy as that. That can get so far. Usually if you have a cove strip up on the top, you can let it dry and then just pull your cove strip up when your daughter attacks up. In this point, we can just take our tape, pull it, and we can kind of just feather that a little bit if we need be, or just wait and, and knock it down later. And there you go. Your code is done. Easy as that. Thank you for watching.